Nacho, am I enthusiastic enough to make it on YouTube? Welcome to the Char Show. Today, we are not only vlogging, but practicing a vlog. We are going to learn how to get B-roll, time lapse, drone, flying, filming, location. Freaking make a vlog, and then edit that vlog. Let's go! Right. My apartment has top the line security. I'm gonna go check out my cameras right now. <laughs> see what's going on outside in the world. Hey! You! What? Stop masturbating on my front foyer! Yeah. Alright, looks like we made it. We made it in. And it's filthy. Way more filthy than I. Than it was last week. It's a mess. It's hard to film in here because it's pretty much just very ugly. But we're gonna try to make it happen, Captain, because we have no other options. You just gotta film, and that's how it is in filming. Things aren't always how they should. And we'll just practice some car cinematography. You'll be a little bit more enthusiastic. What the world? Davy, What's up, dog? You mind helping me move that a little bit? Let's just move it. Let's just move. Sweet. All right, see you, dog. just completely just did not come out right. The car is out of the shot in every single take because I had forgotten my phone clamp that I attached to my gimbalizer that helps me keep the shot in the shot. I couldn't get my polarizer on which gets cast out the reflections in windows and reflections a little bit more. The gimbalizer is fighting me the entire time rendering it completely Useless to be the gimbalizer. I had just gotten sick and tired of the thing at the entire at this point. I had freaking uh, I had just grabbed this protein bar, and it was melted. But anyways, I ate this protein bar, and I had apparently upset this local bee, and the bees freaking started attacking me like nothing. I don't know what a big freaking deal is, dog. I'm just trying to get the protein bar, but the little freaking Barry B Benson, you just want to have it. But anyways, uh, I couldn't obviously end the video here or there. I couldn't end the video here because I haven't got all the footage yet. So I freaking went, uh, <clears throat> so I had freaking, uh, I just grabbed my camera and I went to the next door neighbor who's, uh, who doesn't exist because it's, uh, it's an abandoned shack. My childlike wonders. It's my childhood's dreams 
to abandon the ban the abandoned shacks that homeless guys tie off and shoot heroin into their arms. But anyways, I, I had some found, I had found a, this awesome crow. He was dead though. But like, you know, it's kind of just circle of life. Like, you know, crows are just be dead sometimes, but uh, you know, sometimes they're alive, sometimes they're not. But anyways, and that's kind of just how it is with the, the crows. But, uh, you know, uh, but I, uh, frick, what was I gonna say? If you've ever like gone on YouTube and watched one of those uh, aesthetically pleasing, uh, relaxing street photography POVs of like New York, where there's a cameraman going around GoPro and he's just taking pictures of people without their consent. But anyways, I just created that instead of doing what my original plan was, which was the car cinematography. But uh, I hope you enjoy this next part because it is the best ever street, relaxing street photography video to ever grace the internet. <coughs> I'm gonna get a tick. Wow. Oh, that's a dead crow. <laughs> Make a fine photography photo. See what happens when you drink. You see what happens. You get further away. Perfect. Wow. I got a notification. What's up, Wyatt? You caught me at a good time. I was just about to test this electrical socket with the fork. Oh, shit, are you serious? Well, I was, but this place is abandoned, so I assume it's uh, unplugged. But there's only one way to find out, isn't there? Jeez, bro. <laughs> bro, that's insane. She's getting baptized on Tuesday at 7, kind of by the Institute. Um, and we're just trying to invite as many people as possible. Oh. Okay. Dude, we need to make him make a YouTube video for us. We do. I was actually, uh, I'm shooting one right now. Oh, is that why you're shoving forks and sockets? I am. Um... <laughs> 
next to it is this abandoned shack house thing. Looks like a trailer home. Oh, and and I was doing something else and I was like, you know what, for the rest of this content, I'm just gonna uh, explore my childish wonders and go into that abandoned shack over there. When's your next upload? Uh, I don't know. Are you by yourself or do you have a cameraman out there? I have a GoPro and a camera. Oh, you cut out. What was that? Oh, I said you cut out. Oh, really? It's just a uh, broken glass and whatever's out here. Dude, that's sick. I know. I shouldn't go into this one. But it is very cool and educational. I'd fall right through. My legs are getting eaten up by bugs. What should I title this video? Man, these crickets are fragging loud. Anyways, I don't really know what else to do. I didn't do much talking this time, which is a little bit unfortunate. I guess I just don't feel as lone and able to talk to my free will as I was freaking yesterday. My gosh, so many bugs. Ooh, that's a fine, that's a fine piece of wood. I'd love to step on that. So I feel like my uh, aspirations are To uh, obviously be rich and famous, make money, isn't anybody's. I want to join fun YouTuber groups. And uh, party hardy. Drink milk and party hardy. I want to go to YouTuber parties and turn down drugs and alcohol. Anything that's offered to me. That's a fine looking tire. Why would anyone throw this out? Look at that. Look, a whole row of premium rubber. I don't know, it's kind of not really a picture there.
That's some fine dung. They don't make them like they used to. Oh, tire on the roof. Who knew? Ay, 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 what's on my leg? Oh, ho, ho. Well, we had some fun, ladies and gentlemen. But I think it's time that we go back on home. Where the frick am I? Is that my catchphrase now? Because I seem to say that a lot. Oh, my back. <laughs> my back from carrying all this content. Okay, I guess I'm locked in. Uh, frick, dog. Okay, uh, I don't know where this came from, but I don't know how to get out of here. Am I in trouble? There's, there's no way to open this. Yeah, I don't know what to do. It was was this like content? It's kind of hard to tell until I edit it. Until the audience tells me if it's good content. Was it content? I think I just gotta be consistent. And maybe I'll make it. Anyways. Any party party uh, party arties? Any YouTubers out there, hit me up. <laughs> so I need content. It's freaking awesome, dude. Anyways, thank you. And uh, I hope you subscribe. Because otherwise, how, am, how else am I gonna fund like all the future projects. I can't fund future projects if you're not supporting me. You know what happens when you press that subscribe button and like button? I make money. You're not spending any money, yet I'm getting money because of you. Do you realize how fantastic of a business plan that is? And, and it, entertains me later because I can just go like go-karting later or I can just go buy a car itself and then I can drive that go-kart for content entertaining myself and you for free dude it's just like it's the perfect it's the perfect crime just just, just subscribe I don't know what you're doing not subscribing yet why have you not subscribed yet? Just subscribe and hit that line and we'll both be rich! Was that man yelling at his wife? With content and entertainment! And we're gonna make the world! Is that man yelling at his wife? Welcome home, Elder Plum. Where's the yard sale that might be?